When you add a multiple choice question, the user can only choose one of the options in the list. However, a checkbox question allows them to choose more than one if they like. So to add a checkbox question, click Add Question, choose the question type of checkboxes, and now you can ask your question. Which days work best to conference? And I'll have my options of Monday, Enter, Tuesday, I'm hitting just hitting my Enter key each time, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday. And then as it did happen with the multiple choice, you can have an other line if you like. Now I'm not going to do that here, so I'll get rid of that choice by clicking the X. As with the multiple choice, you can rearrange these by dragging the little dots to the left of the choices. That wouldn't necessarily make sense in this case because I'm using days of the week, but you get the idea that you can rearrange. Also with checkboxes, I think it is very helpful to add a description where you say check all that apply because a lot of times people feel even though they see checkboxes they might not know if they can pick just one or more than one so by including that phrase you're confirming that they can pick any combination of the checkboxes available. Additionally what is a new feature is that you can add images to the choices so if I happen to have an image that uh, here I'll just do a search for Monday and here's a graphic for Monday. Now, of course, you would want to be sure that you're using copyright free images, but you see that you can attach an image to any of the checkbox choices, just like you could do that up here if you wanted with the multiple choice question. All right. Now, um, there is something I do want to mention that's really cool about checkboxes, and I'm going to get into this in a, a different, more advanced video, but a hint is that data validation here allows you to control how many boxes the user can check. You see that you have some options here, select at least, select at most, select exactly, and then you can customize some of these options. So that's a really neat advanced feature, but in terms of a basic checkbox question, we've got one here, and that's how you control that configuration.